Marvel Banks and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to this channel, you want to hit that subscribe button because this channel is for the tea, drama, and story times. And I'm a chick from Brooklyn. Everybody loves a chick from Brooklyn and that's on period. I know I'm coming on here with a dry ass face, but it's because I do have a makeup appointment today. Um, right now that I'm running late for. I wanted to start this, start this vlog way earlier, but my morning was kind of hectic. I had to get my hair done, which you guys saw in the previous video because I'm sure I'm going to upload that video before I upload this video. But as you can see by the title, today I am going to the Little Baby and Little Dirt concert. And I wanted to vlog because if you know me, my number one, 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 number one favorite rapper is Little Dirk. Everybody knows that. All my friends knows that. I'm going crazy. I've been going crazy for Dirk. And this is my opportunity to see him perform. I've never seen him perform before, so I'm super excited. And because I love him so much, I'm going all out. I got my nails done, got my hair done, and I'm getting my makeup done because I do also want to take some cute pictures y'all know i don't usually book anybody to do my makeup but i wanted to I wanted to stand out. I want to stand out. You know, I want to look cute. I'm going to look my best when I'm seeing my favorite artists. So, um, right now I'm waiting for my Uber. Like I said, I'm probably talking hella fast because I'm trying to get this intro together before my Uber's outside. My Uber's 700 feet away. So, I'm going to go to this makeup artist. I've never been to her before, but hopefully it will be okay for me to record. I'm sure she probably won't have an issue with it, but if she doesn't have it, if she does have an issue, I'll just come back after my face is done. So, I'm going to see you guys when I'm getting my makeup done. One eternity later. So, I'm back at home. Now, I know I said I was going to talk to y'all when I was in the hair. I mean, the hair. When I was in the makeup when i was getting my makeup done but i was mad shy like it's mad awkward pulling out a camera when you go into someone for the first time but this is the look ignore my lips i'm gonna change it i was like rubbing my lips together and i changed the lashes nothing wrong with the lashes she put on me but these are my favorite style lashes that i got on right now it's mixed by money so i feel like it's more fitting but this is the face i love it i love it so much um I'm gonna change my lips though. I'm I'm actually about to record a story time right now. Um, being that I have time, but let me tell y'all a little mini story time. So basically, I ordered a shirt to go to this concert. I ordered it on Farfetch last Friday. It shipped, and it was supposed to be out for delivery yesterday. Mind you, I revolved my whole outfit on this one shirt. Like the shirt is basically a highlight. It's a tee, but it, it's just a t-shirt. But it's a designer t-shirt, so it's basically the highlight of my outfit everything else i'm wearing is calm because it is a fucking concert like i didn't want to be overdressed so it was out for delivery yesterday then i got a, a text message saying that the delivery attempt failed but they never came to my house to deliver it it was a fail attempt but it was in the facility in queens so i got very aggravated and i called them and they told me oh no it's gonna be out delivery for out for delivery tomorrow so today i woke up it was saying that it was out for delivery and then it said that it was delayed again and that it's being held in queens at the facility which made me call and i was like can i just pick it up from the facility and she was like yes i was telling her like i need this shirt today like i'm wearing it today well i didn't say it was a shirt but i'm like i need this package today so like can you confirm that i could pick it up and she was like yeah girl girl yeah you could go get it you could go get it and go pick it up just bring your ID now once I start getting ready to go pick it up after I did my hair I got another notification saying that it's on a FedEx truck and it'll be out for delivery so I called again like just to confirm is it coming is it out for delivery they said yes it's out for delivery it's on the truck I'm gonna get it before 8 p.m. now when I'm getting my makeup done I get another notification saying it's a failed attempt which is weird because they're never attempting to deliver it to my house it keeps saying failed attempt but saying jamaica queens and i don't live in jamaica queens so i'm calling at this point i'm fucking aggravated i'm ready to cry i know it's petty but it's really like my whole i like i have backup outfits but i don't want to wear that like i really based my whole everything my makeup everything is based on this outfit so i need this shirt I'm talking fast. I'm, 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 I'm mad, y'all. So I calls again, and I'm like, hey, um, I just got a notification saying that it was a failed delivery. I don't know why I'm saying that, because they never came. And he's like, oh, it's on the truck. You can pick it up after 8, between 8 and 9 at this location. It's the location. The location is in Queens. The concert starts at 8. So I'm over here trying to debate if I'm going to just go pick it up and go straight to the concert. Like I'll wear a tank top and just go pick it up, put the shirt on. But I feel like that's so dirty. Putting the shirt on straight out the packaging. What if it needs to iron? Like I'm just worried about mad shit. But I might have to do what it do. Like I might have to take an Uber 
go get the shirt come back home and go to the concert a little bit late to be fair though the concerts usually have a lot of opening acts in the beginning the real main event doesn't start at the time it says it starts it's usually a lot of shit going on around it so hopefully i can go late i'm actually going by myself that's another story i'm going with someone that i know like my home girl i wanted to go to this concert so bad and like you have to be vaccinated a lot of my friends are not vaccinated and it was hard finding someone to go with but i just wanted to go i would have went by myself if i had to i just want to go have fun and i want to see my favorite rapper like i would never miss this opportunity to see my favorite rapper and I'm gonna go get my shirt because I need to be fly. Like I cannot see Dirk looking bummy. Like my second, my secondary options for outfits is like, uh, it's cute, but like I want it to be cute. Like I want it to be like, mind you, y'all, the shit that I'm wearing is mad calm, but I still, you get what I'm trying to say? Like, am I over exaggerating? I feel like I'm chatting right now, but yeah. Uh, as far as the makeup, I want you guys to comment down below because I want to get my makeup done more. I mean, I know how to do my own makeup, but I feel like. It pops a little bit more when you go to MUA. So let me know in the comments down below how y'all feel about my face. And if I should continue going to this makeup artist. I'm also going to put her information in the description down below. So you guys could book her if you like her face. And she's very affordable um, and very fast. Because she did my makeup in under an hour. But I'm chatting. I'm going to come back with, with an update on what I'm going to do about the shirt before the concert. And I'm going to holla at y'all. So it's dark. You guys can't really see me. But I was able to get my package and I'm hella late. Like, the time right now is 9.59. Oh, y'all yeah, can't see. It's 9.59. .50, and the concert started at 8. But I'm around the corner. Mm, this looks bad. I'm around the corner right now, so I'm gonna hopefully I get in or I'm just gonna have a mental breakdown. And if I do get in, then I'll record once I get in it. I hope bringing my camera won't be an issue. Hopefully not. Pray, cause I don't need any more discrepancies for today. I've gone through enough. But um, I'm gonna come back to you guys once I'm inside. <laughs>
concert. I'm gonna give it a two. What? A two? Why a two? I feel like they was giving because me tired vibes. It was, it was vibes. so short and short. The songs was tired. They was tired. I feel like they was giving tired. Like, yeah. where was that Philly energy? I mean, that Jersey energy. Like, y'all was giving. That was even. Let's do this and go home. Yeah, like wrap it up. They we got the end of the fucking tour. So that was my vlog, my hectic all over the place, little Dirk, little baby concert. Overall, I'm kind of mad. I really didn't see Dirk much. I really wanted to go for Dirk. But that's my fault. I can't even be mad at nobody because I decided to do a whole detour and prolong me going to the concert. I didn't think Dirk was going to be the first, first, first act. And for my friends that was there already told me like they didn't have any opening acts. They just got right into the concert, so which is why I miss Dirk. Um, I seen him a little bit when he came out with Baby to sing the songs that they had together, but I didn't get his whole segment, which I'm kind of tight about. But besides that, I seen Dirk, 42 Doug performed, ESTG performed, A Boogie performed, Capella Gray performed. So I feel like I got a good gist of the concert. I just missed the main event, well, the main event for me, which is my man, but it's all right. Um, I'm about to end this vlog here. I'm also sad that I didn't get any pictures. So I just did all this extra shit for nothing because I didn't get any pictures. I'm going to try to take some now. Mind you, it's 12, 18. I'm going to just try to get me some pictures for the gram because that's why I did all that. And yeah, I'm going to close this out here. If you like this video and you want more vlogs. Tell a friend to tell a friend to hit that subscribe button. Also, comment down below if you are from New York and you was at the Barclays Center, Little Jerk, Little Baby concert. And tell me about your experience because my friend that I went with, she said that she thinks it's like a two. Like, out of experiences, she really didn't have much of a great time. She felt like it was short and she felt like the energy was low. So, let me go. Let me. Let me. Let me know what you guys thought about um the concert. And if you went to see it in your city, let me know. Did you have fun when you went? But yeah, if you like this video and you want to see more videos of me doing story times, vlogs, crime videos, drama tea, all that, tell a friend or tell a friend, hit that subscribe button because we on the road to 50k. And from 50k is 51k, 52k, 53k, 54k, from me is up and it's stuck. <laughs>